G'day, fellas, and welcome to FFA Nomad. We are here. We've got a bit of our, our weird spawn. Apologies for the start. Jeez Louise. Getting myself together over here. We're playing in the French today. Oh, we got ourselves a good little spot. Have a look at this. We got gold. We got double gold. And we got berries. I mean, the berries ain't that hot. I'm going to be honest with you. I kind of prefer the deer. We do have double stone over here. And we got a gold. I'm going to just cancel that town center. Don't mind me. Ladies and gentlemen, everybody get on over here. We are starting off things a little bit differently. So we're playing the French today. And you might be wondering, Drongo, what the hell is up with the French? Why would you play that civilization? They're considered absolutely terrible in FFA. You don't want to be playing them. Well, let me tell you a little bit about a unit called the Abletria. Today, we're going to be just be playing Abletria only. We've done Samurai only as the Japanese. That went out pretty well. We've got ourselves... Cold Pot, what's going on, brother? Cold Pot, don't even think about putting down a town center. Stop. Stop, Cold Pot. Cold Pot, the, co the pot is too cold for you. Now, I could just... Do I just bring Vils over here? Good. <laughs> All right. He, he agreed. The pot was indeed too cold for him. I didn't I didn't even mean to rhyme that. I'm just naturally... Yeah, 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 yeah. Go on. Walla lol all you like, my friend. You... Just too... What? I've never heard that. What the hell? Walla <laughs> That was good. That was very good. I've never heard that one before. Anyway, we got an awesome spawn. We're pretty close to the edge. I do like that, but we're still close enough to the center where we got relics and stuff. Lots of resources around us, abounding us. So my thinking is this. I'm going to go for a fast castle, two towns and a fast castle. But I don't know what landmark to go for. Like, do I just go for that shitty trade landmark? I guess. I guess that's what I go for. Let's see if I can grab this. And boom. Wonderful. There we go. All right, we got it. Good little start, not bad. Um, so we're going to go for a scout. We're going to move it towards the middle. Uh, we're going to be playing Arbletre. We're going to be playing lots and lots of Arbletre. So we need to get Castle Age. Uh, going 2TC is going to be important for us because it's just going to guarantee that we've got a decent economy going into the mid game. Even though ideally, I would love to start off, um, you know, just going straight into the Castle Age. Arbletre is not really a unit that you can just... Uh, I mean, you, you can definitely spam Arbletre. The problem is, like, you're going to need... Now, I will also caveat by this with... Uh, telling you guys that we will indeed be making siege um this game we, you need to have siege right like you just can't not do siege like we're gonna have to have spring lords. we're gonna have to have cannons to get through walls that kind of stuff so that will be on the card oh my god look at these sheep dude i just gotta i gotta keep going for him if you see a sheep you just gotta connect the dots right there beautiful little start so much gold down here so many resources online makes me think we're probably gonna find more relics here uh, but i'm curious to see what kind of um timing we can get for a fast castle uh, we haven't gone for survival techniques, and we probably should have. And even right now, I feel like we could probably go for a survival technique, so let's do it. We're going to open up with the survival techniques. A little bit late here. Um, we've got... Where's our wood line? This is, is this our nearest wood line? I guess it is. And let's keep on keeping on. Uh, one sacred site. It's this single sacred site here. We could go for a sacred victory and just defend with Arbletria. Dude, I would so be down for that. Like, an absolute insane defense. Oh, we should totally do that, dude. White tower, Arbletre on all the walls, just popping off against everyone, dude. Hundred percent. That's gonna be sick. We're gonna do that. We're totally gonna. Oh, I thought we didn't have enough for a house. I was like, oh my god, we forgot our house. We're fine. We're fine. Um, what do we want? Like, so because we're gonna go into. Dude, look at this. How good is this? Um, so we're going to survival techniques. <laughs> Even our mills just picking up sheep out here. Uh, that is a good spot. That's a good spot. Dude, look at this. We've actually got a crazy good spawn here. It, it's in the middle of the map, but that's not a bad thing because of this this giant thing that we've got right here. This, this cliff. So five bills on gold is probably way too many, Gongo. You don't need that many bills on gold. You should know that. So we've got 16 sheep, which is pretty good. I'm happy with that. I think that's a respect 17 sheep. I think it's a respectable number. There's uh, there's quite a few resources out here. It looks like we've got a very hilly map. So I'm going to be looking for that one. We do have two Order of the Dragon players in the game. So just keep that in mind. So we might even have to lock down this relic. I'm thinking second towns and I might throw it here. We do have deer out a little bit further. So I could just go out to them as well. I'm not adverse to that. Another sheep. Um, trade? Trade? Uh, what do we got? Axe is a market. Trains one free trader for each economic technology researched. Uh, I, I can't see the market. That's n point number one. And there's no point in us going into cavalry, right? So... 
Hmm. All right, let's just let's just put it over here. I guess we'll just do do it for the memes. That's blue. Hey blue, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Okay, blue's up there as well. Um, do we want to collect? I mean, this is gonna give us traders, but like, what are we gonna do with traders? I don't know if we're really gonna do too much with traders. Uh, let's think about that second TC though. Uh, Lama camp. Are we really putting it over here? Guess we go like right in the corner like this. I mean, we could just put it there. I kind of want to hide it though. I think hiding it's cool. And then these vills here. We can send them out as well. So that's going to be what? Nine vills over on wood. And then that leaves these two. Let's go eight vills on wood. And then the rest can go on gold. So we're just going to do like very, very, very strict fast castle. No upgrades. No, no nothing silly. We've got more food up here. This is where we we were originally going to go. Dude, this is this is such a resource rich environment. Target rich environment, more like resource rich environment. Have a look at this. Another relic. More more deer. Can we do we just like stonewall blue in and say see you later blue? Blue's playing ottomans. Hot worst is the first one up. So we got po worst and we got cold pot. So both Chinese players, or both players playing the Chinese. Oh, he's pretty quick. He was pretty quick. No stopping that one. Alright, so we need... Whoa, whoa! Orange got eliminated. No, green got eliminated. Orange gets a kill. One kill, orange. So we got so much food here. Teal's up here. Just gotta leave him. Oh gosh, he's actually close. Was it purple? Yeah, no, we're purple. Who was it that we said early? Was it cold pot? Yeah, cold pot. He was too cold for the pot. Wasn't he? Teal's pretty close, and he's playing the Chinese, so he could look to barbican us. So maybe let's just keep an eye out on that. I mean, he could have people in his back, like we know that cold pot... Um, wait, that is cold pot. Dude, that's cold pot from earlier. Hmm, we don't want to mess with cold pot. Our pots are not hot enough for this. Okay. So I'm going to look for one early kill here. All right. There's our traders coming online. I don't know where the mar neutral market is. There's pink. Wonderful. We got pink in the middle here as well. Nice relics here for you. I got a little bit of vills here on on stone. So we're going to make up. We're going to make some traders here. So I'm thinking we go all eco upgrades after age, after we get our second TC. That's going to be enough for us. And TC on gold, on double gold. Sure, I'll take that. Is there any market? No, 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 no. Dude, everyone's in the middle. Dude, talk about Malcolm this game. We've got everybody nice and close to us here. Um, wheelbarrow, let's go. So I think at this point, we just want to rally almost 100% to food. So 10 vils, probably too many for that. Am I just going to have to delete this? I mean, normally the neutral trading post is in the middle. Let's, can we put you on patrol? This is going to get really annoying real quickly, just constantly having to move this idol. Mage up coming through. School of Cavalry here for yellow. Looks like blue should be able to get in on the backside. I should not have gone this landmark. Maybe. Hmm. Alright, let's get our upgrades. We can probably pull off a fair bit from here. Let's just go on to gold for now. And let's get our upgrades here. We're going to want to get double broad axe, but we don't need it right now. And then from there, we want to we want to go straight into a um, a keep. So we're going to a keep, and then archery rangers on the keep. And then that's going to give us reduced price. Dude, there's literally no neutral trading post, unless it's like on the edge of the map. But even then, that, that'd be kind of weird. Do I just do I just delete you? It's kind of annoying just having you here. Wait, 
Dude, I, I, I keep like, I keep checking. Um, let's go. Let's get you a little bit closer. How many traders do we have? We've only got the one trader. Feudal Edge. What have we spotted? We've spotted an enemy scout. Alright, everybody come out. We're just going to do a little bit of a... A little bit of a rotation here. House is coming up. A lot of bills on gold here. Let's move them over. So we're going to go for guild hall. Now, where are we putting the guild hall? We could put the guild hall in the corner right here. Because I don't think anybody's really going to get to this. I probably don't want to eat through this wood too much. I think we want to leave this here. I don't know where else we're going to get wood from, though. That's the next question. I could just put my landmark up here. Oh, and I... Did I... I think I just selected them. That's why that happened. Do we just move some vills up there now? But what happens if Teal spots that? I could stonewall the landmark in. I think that's the play. I stonewall the landmark in. Because that's going to be an important landmark. Alright, we've got ourselves some traders going on here. Uh, have we picked up all of our eco upgrades? I think we have. That's our scout. Now, we can also look to trade to somebody's market for the memes. Okay, we're going to wait for that. So now what we're going to do is look to grab a little bit of stone. We're also going to throw down some archery ranges, but we want to get our keep up first because that's going to reduce the cost. So I'm going to put it right here, I think. I just want to make sure that we can actually build everything here. Yeah, this is a really good spot. So I'm going to start with my archery rangers here in this corner. Like that. So, if I want to go there... Is there a way through? No, 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 no. Don't die. That's where we gotta go. Right here. Alright, we got lots of stone on the way. Got our age up coming through. So these guys will stonewall this off. Do I make a gate? I don't know if I need a gate. A lot of gold coming through, so we look for our upgrades as well. Phil's moving on the way back. So two TCs has actually done pretty well for us here. So oh, we can probably add a couple more Vils over here. Let's just get you to rally. So we will start with Ablatria straight away, but we'll look to get a keep up as well. Um, I think we're going to put the guild hall on... Do we want it on food or gold? We've got a lot of gold, but keeping it on food means we don't have to farm transition as much. Do I just like send these guys to chill in the sacred site or something? Maybe that's the play. Uh, that's off, isn't it? That's on. Castle Age is now coming through. Let's, uh... I guess we have to make a, a gate here now. We'll keep it on food. Alright, so Ablatria number is rising. This is a good thing. We want to invest in Ablatria stocks right now. We don't have any houses. Let's get our double next upgrade. Keep us online. More than enough right now. This house can't come up fast enough. Throw that in. Let's go get this relic here. Let's go get this relic on this side. Okay, 
Okay. I'm feeling this one. This is feeling good. How long have you guys just been standing there, looking? I'm just gonna delete these guys. I couldn't find a, a market. These are pretty cheap, right? Oh my god, they're so cheap, dude. So it's gonna be three relics for us. There's also a fourth relic towards the north here that we can look to take. We need to get more archery rangers in, and I add, need to add more houses. The only thing I'm kind of scared of is that we got blue to our back, and I don't know who's in front of or who's behind me. It's a herbal sheep. We want a vill. We'll go a sprinkled emplacement on this bad boy. Why not? Houses are coming up. Do we get that relic? We did get that relic. Wonderful. So let's get you guys to drop off. And then after you have done that, you can come up and grab this one and then bring it back down. Alright, we've got our blacksmith now. Let's get our upgrades. We can also think about getting gambesons here, which is going to give us melee armor. And then we probably want to look to move into... Hmm. I kind of want to take out Teal just because of his proximity to me, but I'm really scared with blue in my back. Speaking of in my back, let's have a look. Yeah, we need to take out blue. Blue is in the castle age, and he is playing as... Now uh, he's playing as the... What do we want? We want this bad boy right here. Uh, as the Ottomans, which means we are going to need Springholds. Alright, gold is exhausted. Good news is... There's plenty more where that came from. Let's delete these. Also, let's get a couple more over here. We don't have a whole lot of people over on this east side of our, us. Which is going to make it really easy to defend. Do we get this relic? We did get this relic. We've got the tier 2 upgrades. Wonderful. Tier 2 upgrades on everything. Okay, so that's pink killing cold pot. Where's the king? King is in here. Oh, these guys are really close, actually. Got some decent arbitrary numbers up now. Main issue we're having here is wood. Alright, so you're going to build this, and then we're just going to try and get a little bit more line of sight out here. Here we go, here we go. Let's keep an eye on that king. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Fucking A, dude. Have we got Siege Engineering? Okay, that was what I needed to be worried about. I don't know where that king went. Fuck. Chess 
No, the king. I just come down over here. I'm trying to. Oh, population capacity reached. with that angle. Just like that. Did I really lose that Springle just then? Oh, I did too. Shit, I just lost both of those. You guys been idle for we need more sage we need way more sage we don't have enough um i feel like my fucking macro is so terrible right now dude oh, i fucking hate these idols man my town center is just constantly idling out like this it's infuriating to me oh we lost more vills? What are we on? 84, not the best. We need more sage. I'm gonna have to drop a market here. That's fine. Oh, we can take this. We can go imp. I don't know if I want imperial. Of course I want imperial. If I put that here now, they know about it now. Dude, why, why are these bills always idle? Landmark under attack. It's got three. Jacko's that's orange. Orange was the one who got the kill before. What is it with my fucking bills, man? I actually have so many issues with my bills. Is that? Uh, my guy's still Castle Edge. I'm not really liking my position, to be honest. I lost a lot of ills in that fight, and that wasn't a good thing.
Always idols over here on the on the wood line. I don't know what it is with the wood line. Coldpot got eliminated. We know where the king was, but I don't know if we can really go for it. Can we get king locations? I don't know why that's there. Oh now, bro. Not now, bro. Oh man. It's one of those things where should have been very aware. The fuck? Oh, it's those Woodvilles. Keep. King is still alive back here. I'm trying to. Oh, because I'm selecting the fucking battering ram I exist. I already built. Oh my lord, this guy's fully geared up over here. Look at this freaking triple keep over here for yellow. Damn, dude, mad respect. I'm really fighting out of the pocket right now, though. <laughs> Did we switch this to gold? We did. Good. I need him for roller shutter triggers. This is gonna be a hard game, dude. I can feel it already. We want to avoid going through here again. We can just wait for Imperial, dude. Like, we're going Imp right now. We go Imp, we get Roller Shot Triggers, we win. He's Imp as well. Oh my god. 
classic. Classic. Hmm. This guy's actually playing pretty well. My main concern right now is like... We got bombards somewhere. It's going to be great bombards soon. Please don't tell me that's attacks on me. Why does it sound like it's on me? It fucking is, dude. Roller shot triggers, please, Drongo. Let's go. Why do I hear bombards or cannons or something? University? Let's go. Let's get our next gold upgrade as well. I don't know if we'll be able to take that. We'll try that. Roller shutter triggers this through. Has he picked it up? He hasn't. Go now, go now. Destroyed so hard in that fight. I don't do any damage to that. Only 100 bills. Dude, this, why is it so hard to crack this guy? Is it because I don't have fucking a vision up here, dude? I swear to God, that's gotta be it. It's so difficult for me to crack this guy. We lost this. There's a keep here. I don't know how many bills we lost in that fight. It's only got a thousand left on it. I'm not going to bother. Dude, how am I maxed? I have 95 apparently. Where, the rest, where are the rest of my arbs? Incendiary Arrow Siege Works. Oh, that's where they are. That's not good. That's not good. Fucking A, bro.
That's not good. to that at landmark i fucking am dude is that hand cannon is no it's not that's probably enough arbitrary right now i'm just fucking throwing up a keep right here Dude, look at that. It's running bills across. Fuck yes. Dude, that was hard, man. You played a good fight, dude. Can't get these fucking... Dude, you just know Yellow is sitting on so many resources right now. Holy moly, dude. That was not an easy fight. Okay, so is that three? One, two, three. Oh, red's also in this game. Dude, I've lost so many bills here. This fucking keep actually just destroyed me. We can probably just afford to come over here right now with oh, traders, dude. I totally forgot about my traders. Look at this. Holy fuck, we have 140 Arbolatrias. I think that's enough, Drunga, with Arbolatrias. This guy's definitely going to be my biggest threat here. I mean, we could go take this guy. He's kind of just chilling. So we clear this, re-wall, and then we go kill pink. Yellow's still over here. Where are landmarks for yellow, actually? Red Palace is here. We got so many bills in queue. Uh, let's make sure we get all of our upgrades here as well. We want to get chemistry. We want to get siege works. And I want to put my king somewhere safe. I feel like we can probably go for just a couple more cannons here. And then the rest just villages. We want to build our economy massively. I don't feel safe at all. Like, I'm not safe. What do we got here? Battering room. So I could take Sacred Sight. I don't feel comfortable with it right now. I think we definitely want to go in and, and hit this guy. I need to wall the keep and put it back here. Oh, 
I didn't even realize he went for it. For it. I mean, we do have to be careful with this backside because he could look to try and snake through. Maybe let's put another set of walls up here. Just so he doesn't try and hit me with bombards. And let's get our king back over there. Still got the king over here. Oh, dude, we got seven cannons. That's kind of nice. See, my main fear right now is just no stone walls. We've got lots of stone in that. Actually, let's take this stone out just so we can finish this. Actually, can we finish this right here if we just put that there and then put this like that? Yes, dude. Perfect. Gotta be careful of launch connect. These are all launch connect, but we've we are split. Jeez, that was not what I expected. GG, he says. Okay, I'm feeling it. He's running king. Take it back, he's not running king, he's sending king. Okay, now have we got our university upgrade? Let's pick that upgrade up now. These bills are gonna have to be deleted. Sorry guys. Okay, so we're up against red. We still don't have a lot of resources, or a lot of bills. We've got one monk. Let us begin. Where are our nearest bills? Definitely want stone walls. Stone wall this in. Double. It's 3.6k. Lovely. So I'm going to start with a nice close stone wall. Is that? That doesn't look holy to me. There we go. Beautiful. That's exactly how I vision envisioned it. We know that there's vills over here, so let's go clear them out. I need more vills in this vicinity. We need to get more walls up. Something like that. Let's get boiling oil. Let's get a couple of cannon emplacements. Let the maze begin. Where were the arms? Did I not did I not bring arm Latria? I thought I did. Little couple of scouts out here. 
I mean, do I really need to wall this in? I can just put like... What of hills over there? He's got a lot of resources, man. If he's... Like, surely he's got plenty of resources sitting back there. Hmm, I love that. I love that so much. What are all these scouts? What's his plan? What's he thinking? I feel like this stone should not be here. Let's... What are we on? We're on gold. Let's switch it. Get rid of our traders. I was looking for my landmarks. He wants to go for a snipe of some sort. Uh, do we try and wall everything in? Split up here. We've got a market. We've got this technology, but kind of useless. I, I know something is coming. I just don't know what it is. So do we just go ham with the walls? They're not pushing me. I mean, I got, they got five minutes. Are they fighting each other? Um, guys? Dude, this is insane. Oh my god, the nest of bees! And the bombards. What is that kind of push? What's he, what's he going for on that angle? Four minutes, it's a fair amount of time. That's a lot of nest of bees, bro. up on my walls. I got any bills around here? Oh, 
Oh. Trying to dodge it. Lost it all. Oh, I didn't have any units queued up. Oh, that's not good. Dude, those nest of bees don't mess around. We've got yellow in the back here as well. Don't you love that? Angle between wall is too shallow. Whatever the fuck that means. Oh! Damn, dude! We're messing around. It's a lot of bombards and shit. You know, if, if we could get this walled in, please. Fuck, this is so annoying, dude. What is this stupid bug? It's open yellow. Yeah, bro. If, if only it couldn't be, though. Two minutes to go. Dude, and if, if, if only I could just get this fucking wall up, dude. I'm sorry, but it's so stupid, man. Like, if this wall is up, he can't get through here. My timer is down. Like, I'm only losing this game right now because I can't get this fucking wall up. Is that why? Is it because the original wall was across here? And so it, it's like, it's thinking about its original positioning that's gj i'm done i mean i can still try and fight it out maybe I, you know what let's tr let's try and fight it out you know we we we've lost right now we're on stone where's my king king's back here so he's fine right, these guys these poor guys get value oh you can Market? Where's my market at? It's in here somewhere, right? There, that'll do. So they've neutralized the sacred site now. I'm down to 36 bills, by the way. 36 units. So the only way back into this is by doing this. I mean, yellow is so well set up for this, though. This is the other thing to know. Now I need space, right? Like, that's the other thing I, I need now. I need space. So I've lost one landmark, but I've got this in the back. That was always my plan from the very beginning. So what do we want to rally to? I think we want to rally just to food. We're still making arbs. We don't, definitely don't have the gold to kind of flex. Or are we going to lose these? Enemy destroyed. Well, that's good. If, if red can kill yellow, that's for sure. I mean, this is his starting landmarks though, right? So we want them to fight against each other. Let's move these relics back over here. So we're just going to do like a, an arbitrary cannon combo, I guess? Oh my god, we never got our T3. Which is not a bad thing, because we can get it now. 
So he can clear this one out. Okay, so it wasn't successful, but we're not going to surrender, right? Like, we're just... We're going to we're gonna still keep our head up. So come out, take this relic, and then go and put it in here. So just remember, our town center's train village is much faster as well. So we're going to be able to boom back pretty quickly. We're on 300 pop, or at least we've got 300 pop max. So as long as these two are relatively even, and to be honest, they did kind of feel like they were even in these fights. Trying to grab that one in for me, mate. And then come back and grab this one. And then throw it in there. Let's get a couple more vills up here. We don't want to go too crazy on it. And we can probably rally over to wood as well. So as long as we get left alone, we're going to be okay. Right? Right, guys? We're on food at the moment. I'm just going to cancel that. We're going to go back to gold. Just because gold's going to be the issue later on. So we've got eight town centers at the moment. I think that's what it is, right? A capital town center and then everybody else. And they've kind of just left me alone, which is good. Got a couple more farms that we can fill out over here. So let's bring you guys in. Oh, uh, Red, I don't want, I don't like you over here. I'm going to ask you politely to move with my units. Now, we're not making all of our units discounted. That's the other thing to note, is where a lot of these units aren't being discounted. At least I... That's, that's a lot of mangoes, dude. That's the problem when you've got this many mangoes. It's like, I need a way to take those out. And I, I guess I could probably use... um. Let's get our wood gatherers here. Get out of here. Don't fuck out. That's mine. Dude, I still got a trader in here. Respect my little trader. Do your thing. I never know if we've got enough houses. Oh yeah, maximum of 300 pop, so we do have enough houses. Oh, accident archers? Accidental archers? Oh, that's annoying. So do we go into Springles here? I'm just going to stop that. Let him know my boundaries. I'm going to say these are... These are my boundaries, buddy. I don't know if I can necessarily play Springles, though. I don't I don't feel comfortable going Springles. I, I feel like just going Mass Bombards is probably a better choice. I do have the cannon ability, right? G? No? Oh my god, dude. Okay, let's start making some cannons. Things are about to get serious. How much is that? That's 1,600. Oh my god, that's 7k, dude. Oh, that's 7k. We've done a good job to bring our resource spending back in line with where it should be. I'm just going to throw this up like that. Just so his AI doesn't think it's open. I need a lot more vills on gold. Hmm. So it's this gold right here. So let's hand in our wood. And we'll just go take this one. Is there a world where we can actually just go for a fucking snipe? Maybe that's the play. I'm confident I can beat red. Okay. I don't... How many landmarks does he have? Destroy enemy landmarks. So three out of 11 are destroyed. So if we assume all of reds are alive, I think that means that these 
free from yellow have been destroyed. So, if we extrapolate... Hmm. Can you come over here? No. What happens if I tell you to go here? Okay, good. We lost a lot of bills before from that. Got a lot of resources, dude. This is not bad. It's 500 gold on that. Six, 7k on this. This is a big... This is, this is nice, actually. We pick up all the relics. One more. That's 68 bills, dude. He wants that gold bad. Where do we go? I fucking hear it, dude. Yep, I heard him in the. He's coming for event with a vengeance. Really? Everybody moved over to that side? Fuck off, dude. Why- why- why are you so stupid? Look at these- Oh, they're going through the gate. Okay, okay. They're going through the gate. No, no, no! Look at these dumb motherfuckers. There's too many, dude. Has he got calves in there? Hmm. Hmm. How do I... Like, there's too many bombards as well. Like, he's got fucking eight cannons. I don't... We don't want to fight him. We just want him to chill. Did this cannon make its way up? So we don't want him to fight us. We just want to chill. <gasps> Ah, he's going for a snipe. How are we going to deal with that? Red, help. He's killing me. I feel like 49 arms is probably enough. Let's bring these guys to kill the cannons. What was that sound? We want to find the Vils. Probably escaped. Cool, so we shut that down. Fuck off, dude. What are the fucking odds? What are the fucking odds? You're sending units right here, right fucking now, as I literally just broke that down. What are the odds of that, dude? This is the only real way I can get through, I think. 
We could just bring a cannon over here and try and take this out instead of having our bills. Okay, so he's shot that down. Does he have vision here? Is that why he knew? How did he know? What, he's just fucking scouting it out just to see what's going on? How many have we got? We got seven bills here. He got what he came for. Oh, we never brought you guys out. Shit. Okay, what are we on here? We're on gold on this. So we just leave that for now. This is our this is our win condition up here. 100%. As I said, I'm confident we can take out. Red. Oh, that, that's been eaten. Okay, so hopefully he doesn't have line of sight over here. Oh, he's building a fucking wonder. Oh shit, that's not good because that means he's preparing for defense. Okay, um... Mad respect, first and foremost. Uh, we need to just get our siege on. So let's go over here and we'll start building our siege. So we're going to have to delete Vils again, which is absolutely fine. We like, we don't mind doing that. So I'm going to start by deleting these Vils. I'm going to hand in on these. Can probably keep these alive for a little bit longer. We do have 15 minutes. But we need to go into a lot of cannons. Red. He has Wanda. Need to kill. This has been a crazy game, actually. I know. Okay, just make sure. Attack, same time. Oh, you bills. Oh, I accidentally right-clicked the wrong thing. Okay, so we want to go for... Sage. Pagoda? Okay. Maybe Reboldequins as well? Maybe we get the Randy out? The main issue is going to be Mangoes, right? We've got plenty of food here. I'm not fussed about that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you guys doing? I don't want to get too close because he's got outposts. And then he'll just run and... Even that's maybe a bit close. Well, jigs up. 
I attack from top. Where else have we got Woodville's? Up here. I should have made more gates here. Good thing we've got this bad boy right here. 7k, let's take it. Okay, let's attack. Are you there? Can we just kill the landmark? If I just kill this landmark, does he just die? I'm in? Bro, don't you fucking dare, I see you. Imagine if I literally just kill this landmark and he just loses. Can I get a king check quickly? Before I take out the landmark? I see you here, brother. Okay, I attack you. Stop now, or I don't kill. I'm back yellow. I don't know where that last landmark is. It looks like he's up there.
is slowly getting there. Doesn't feel like he's got much momentum back there, not gonna lie. Let's see if we can get that king snipe. I, I kind of want to just wait with the king snipe here. I, I want to let him... I want to let wear him, let red wear himself out. That's the landmark right there. We could just kill it right now. But I need to get this one up first. Okay, we're up. Him. He's done. GG Purple? GG I mean he can't take the sacred right? Like we just We just kill everything Are we still on gold? Still in gold, 2k. Uh, markets? Didn't have gold the whole game. You and me both, brother. He's just only making spears. I think they're all out of gold, dude. And we got that French bonus, baby. Dude, look at the bombards I've got here. Not gonna lie, man. We are absolutely stacked. He's, he's trying for it. Same. I'm just going to say same. All sacred sites. Uh, are we all landmarks online? We are. He might know about this one in the back. Liar. I don't know, man. I... Dude, I'm actually maxed. 251 right now. You had the middle. This is true. Dude, look at my bombards. Alright, king check. I can't believe we actually came back into this game. He's marching the king out, dude. Where are these vills? I had vills somewhere. Did I delete them? Oh, there they are. Wonderful. Okay, I'm... I'm pretty happy with how this went. I don't think it could have gone much better than that. I mean, we could have won with the sacred victory. So we just want to be getting line of sight up. We need to be aware of a potential snipe attempt. But I think this is where most of his units are. We're full arbs. <laughs> He's making palace guards, dude. Uh, I think I'm going to take gold. 
Dude, this is this is what it's all about. Come get it, dude. There it is, dude. He's he's got the he's just gonna run it out. He's he's left it out. Execution by Rebaldequin. Sir, can I interest you in a Rebaldequin? So have you had a, heard about our good lord savior, Randy? Randy? Have you heard about Randy, sir? Sir, can I interest you in Randy? There he is, ladies and gentlemen. We've done it. Only arbitrary. I mean, I say only arbitrary, but... I think the real star of the show here was the Rebaldequin. Mr. Randy. Dude, how did we not... Oh, man. You know what, what it was that did it for me that game? It's the wall on the sacred site. I just... I was so... What's the word? Upset. Upset. It, it just does this little thing. And I think that this is part of, like, playing Age of Empires, right? Nice, nice farms down here. I'll say that much. One of the things about playing Age of Empires is you can bitch about the bugs or you can bitch about the mechanics or you can play the game and know that they exist and make sure that you not necessarily exploit them, like transport ship deleting king. That's not an acceptable exploit, right? Um, whereas like in that situation, knowing how the, that works or, or like using pathing as an example. So for me, like if I if I want to move all of my units down here, instead of right clicking down here, what I will do is right click this market. And what that's going to do is it's just going to make them path so much better uh, through those those buildings. Um, so it's just knowing how the game works. But over, overall, I think we did pretty well here. This was a tough game. I'm not going to lie. Like when, when we go back to the very beginning, uh, we had at, at the very first stage, I think it was Teal who was going to be putting down his town center. In fact, we, can we go check? Stop, cold pot. The pot is too cold for you. <laughs> and there he is. So we had Teal who was putting down his town center a little bit too close. He ended up putting it down over here. Still probably a little bit too close. He gets caught. And I mean, it's going to happen when you've got this kind of mega random map where there's just mountains everywhere, right? Like it's just natural. Um, but realistically, we had a great little spot here. Uh, my only concern was blue to the back. We managed to get him and, and thank the Lord that he just kind of gave up once we pushed him and he knew that like, he, he knew the jig was up and it was only a matter of time, but it just meant we could reallocate resources to the front straight away instead of having to worry about it. We just sent five arbitrators to his town center, get the kill, wonderful, done. That's the town center right there. And then we had, I mean, there, there was Pink who was doing a little bit of an escape route. <gasps> The king was never taken out, dude. I knew I should have sent Arbs down there. I knew it, dude. I even said, I said specifically, I should send Arbs down there. Go back, listen. I said it, dude, because I knew where the king was. And that's the thing to remember that when you do the king scan, uh, you don't actually see kings from eliminated players. You only see kings from existing players. So it means that once the player has just surrendered or given up or lost all their landmarks, that you don't actually... Did he lose all of his landmarks? He may have lost his landmarks. Oh, I think he lost his landmarks. Oh, he did too. Look at this. He was trying to put down another landmark, but they've all gone down and he got eliminated. <sighs> sucks. Sucks. Definitely, definitely sucks. Is it pink or teal? I think this is pink, right? Because that's teal. That's teal. Hold on. Pink is Order of the Dragon. It had to be teal. Was this teal? Yeah, it was teal. It was, this was Cold Pot. It was, weren't there two Chinese players in this game today? Two, two Chinese civilizations? Yeah, they were. Oh, red. Where was red? Was this red? This is teal, right? I can see like little bits of teal. Where was red? Oh, no, this was red. Oh my gosh, I tell you what. It's, it's getting too late. It's getting too late. It's 10.30 at night for me. Um, how did we do here? I think we did very well. I, I think we utilized... Um, so this is one of the big things as well that I like to do. Lots of town centers in the back. That way you can repopulate. Let's say you do delete... Wait, we won't even full pop. Uh, let's say you do delete all your vills. This is going to mean that you can regen that village account so much faster. Uh, and that's exactly what we looked to take advantage of this game. So you can see the village account comes down to pretty close to zero. I mean, you can see green was sitting on this village account the whole game. So it's about five. So I think we were sitting on about five villagers here. Uh, managed to get ourselves all the way back up to 100 and... Look at that, 140. Pretty damn quickly. So very, very nice little boom there. Definitely out of the gates the fastest as well. Only on 2TC and we were still out of the gates the fastest. Uh, let's have a look at the military count. So that big fight there in the middle with the sacred site. Uh, obviously we lost everything. Uh, but fortunately, we, di we didn't even really need to convince them not to attack us. They just kind of knew. And I think that's probably the best part about FFA is when there's three players left. It is very much a game of chess and knowing when I should push, when I should hold. 
Uh, and to be honest, these guys both made the right decision, right? Like, you want to end me, but at the same time, with the position I put this landmark, you're going to need to invest a lot. We were fortunate. We did the right thing. We scouted with our outposts. Uh, we saw this little attack that was coming. And this could have been, you know, this could have been really hard. He runs in with a whole bunch of knights. Cannons come through. Cannons kill this. Cannons kill this. Knights come through. And the knights kill... Or the White Tower's already... Or the um, Red Palace is already dead. Um, so he just cannons this, cannons this, and then just comes into the back. Boom, boom, dead. And that's it. And there's nothing you can really do to stop that. So that was a really nice play by him. Nice attempt by him, but unfortunately doesn't come through. And it's all just about having those outposts on the edge. You know, like if he had had outposts over on this side and I mean, he did he did kind of see me over here, but he should have had outposts here just so he could see what I'm up to and then send units to kill me before I'm there. Once I'm in position, then it's a little bit different. But uh, yeah, anyway, overall, I'm pretty happy with how that went. And uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Jeez, that was an absolute banger.